Well hello and welcome to this Ewood Railway update. Just a few things that I've done, not too much. No Magna Rail but there's other things to do I guess. You may notice on this football stand I've now added some advertising hoardings at the top there. I think it gives the stand a bit of depth, gives it a bit more interest, more to look at. Um, future plan, might be looking at putting a floodlight in. Maybe some LEDs on the top, something for me to think about. Just added a little bit of detail there to the uh, church. I've just added the clock face, two identical clock faces, one on each side like so. Just took a picture of a church and uh, basically cut it out. Happy with the size and there we go. Looks a nice addition I suppose. Gives it a little more to look at. Um, Weather my track, um, I've used some rail match, I think it's 406, as you can see just down the edges, the rails, so you've now got the effect of the uncleanliness of the rails, um, where the track, where the oil's spilt etc, and it makes a nice contrast with the existing colour, I think that's come out really really well. That's a big thank you to New Junction for that one. Watched his video. I didn't use an airbrush. Literally did exactly the same method as what he's done. Which is uh, just a paintbrush. 50-50 mix. Uh, two pots of 18mm. Did the whole of my layout. So if you are thinking of doing anything like that. You can appreciate how much track I've got. Work it out for yourself. Um, final thing. I bought this uh, diesel fueler here. Um, and I had lifted it up because I was having trouble getting the uh, engines underneath it well now I've decided I've actually painted this top surface here of it to match exactly to the same colour as the uh, floor for the depot there and I've just literally just lifted these edges up so now the 25 and whatever else fits just nicely underneath it um, just moving out of the way for a minute there. Um, on the tr on the uh, floor here, underneath, what I'm going to do is use some oil spill. I've got that ready, but there's a bit of drying time, so uh, that'll be a job for another day. Just to put in between the rails here and the edge of the uh, fueler, the base for the fueler. So all in all, very very pleased. No magna rail today. Um, that's still very much in the uh, process of being made and giving me an headache. But uh, I hope you've enjoyed this update and thanks very much for watching.